Welcome to our channel. Sharon Stone questions integrity of recent Johnny Depp project. He's making a fortune. Sharon Stone has taken a swipe at Johnny Depp in a new interview about her success in the art world. The Hollywood star, whose credits include Basic Instinct in Casino, has turned her back on acting to pursue her painting skills, and she cast aspersions on an art collection created by Depp that fetched millions in 2022. Stone reignited her passion for art during lockdown and decided to embrace the skill full-time after failing to be offered roles she believed were worthy of her talents. She has now opened her own exhibition in Berlin, and another is due to open in San Francisco in April. However, while she acknowledged that her rapid success in the art could probably be attributed to her fame, the actor told The Guardian she has several obstacles as she isn't necessarily painting art that galleries want. Here, Stone hit out at Depp's lucrative art collection, stating, Johnny Depp is printing pictures of people, putting some paint over it and signing it, and making a fortune. Stone was referring to Depp's Friends and Heroes an art collection featuring 780 prints of famous faces, which he sold for an estimated $3.65 million. He followed this up with even more prints in 2023, which included the faces of famous figures such as Heath Ledger and Hunter S. Thompson. Also last year, Depp unveiled a self-portrait, which captures the emotional exhaustion he felt during a difficult period in his life. The actor donated $200 from every sale of the picture to Mental Health America. Stone said curators have made requests seemingly based on Depp's success, telling the outlet, I had galleries approach me and say, could you please make prints of your face? I think it's my duty not to do that. It's my job to open a window for other women and hold it open further. In the past, Stone has been supportive of Depp in regards to his personal life. Addressing his high-profile court case with ex-wife Amber Heard, Stone told The Telegraph in 2020, I've known Johnny from when he was a kid, and he's a terrific guy, sweet and nice and very warm and generous. So I have a feeling it's more about this young lady. On Wednesday, 20 March, Depp responded to an accusation that he treated his Blow co-star Lola Glaudini aggressively on the film set. A rep for the actor denied Glaudini's claims, saying, Johnny always prioritizes good working relationships with cast and crew, and this recounting differs greatly from the recollection of other members on set at the time. The Independent is the world's most free-thinking news brand, providing global news, commentary, and analysis for the independently minded. We have grown a huge global readership of independently minded individuals who value our trusted voice and commitment to positive change. Our mission, making change happen, has never been as important as it is today. 